everyone and welcome to this crafty Amazon gift guide. I, like many other people, uh, rely on Amazon this Christmas 2021 uh, in the current climate. It's of course nice to get stuff from little independent shops, but with the postal service, it's um, sometimes difficult <laughs> to get stuff in time. So yeah, without any further ado, Let's start and um, I hope that you find something for the crafty person in your life. The first thing is this Tonic Studios Tim Holtz stamp platform. When I started crafting, we didn't have one of these and I went looking back at how many times I've tried stamping a clear stamp or a rubber stamp perfectly and it didn't turn out that good so I needed to throw the paper away um, but with that, with this little guy here, it's not too, so little, it's uh, I think 8x8 eight eight size, this one. Uh, they've got a smaller one and larger one as well, I think. Um, but with this one, you will never, ever <laughs> stamp an uncleared image again. So this is a really good gift for someone that loves um, clear stamps, rubber stamps. Um, it's, it's just perfect. Then we've got uh, some storage gifts. I love receiving storage gifts like this because um, as a crafter it's it's not fun to spend money on storage but it's definitely necessary to have storage. Um, I actually asked for this last Christmas um, because I, I wanted a place to store all my miniature distress ink pads in and I've also got my memento pads but this is such a handy thing like if I go traveling somewhere and I want to get this take this with me I literally just grab it and um, it keeps them protected and it's, it's just great so this is a, a perfect gift to give someone actually that crafts because storage it, it's really nice to receive storage uh, then keeping on the storage theme um, art bin has uh, these um, kits that you can buy uh, so it's the art bin uh, company where you can keep your uh, dice your metal dice stored on so if your crafter has um, metal dice like this and they want to store them um, you can get these kits with a few of these metal boards that you can put your metal dice on and then you also get the art bin um, that's once again something that's kind of boring as a crafter to spend money on because you want to buy the actual dice itself but to receive um, an art bin with some storage metal storage boards is, is just great i would be super happy about that then my next gift recommendation is to get the crafter in your life a mini die cutting machine if they already have a big die cutting machine they will love you <laughs> if you get them a mini one if they don't already have one if i could choose any of these between any of these two i would go for the gemini i've had a fabulous time with this one you can actually get quite a lot of dies through the Gemini Mini so I would go for the Gemini Mini it's also cheaper than the sidekick so and it, it's been fabulous um, so yeah I recommend the Gemini Mini give that to a crafter and they will be loving you <laughs> if the crafter in your life has a die cutting machine that's an electronic die cutting machine you could get them a complete card making USB set like this one from Cutting Craftorium. Um, this is a um, it's a USB stick with I think it's about 200 yeah so about oh 75 complete projects so what you get in this um, and what you can give them is pretty much SVG files to create different types of projects so this little USB set is called complete card making so you get a ton of different SVG files to create um, different types of cards you've got a lot of things in this and to be gifted one of these um, little USB 
um, kits is really great because um, they can be a little bit on the pricier uh, side um, but to be gifted one of these as a crafter is just so fun because I collect SVG files <laughs> so um, that's a, another recommendation and you can also get these on eBay uh, if you wanted to buy secondhand. Um, then I got these um, punch boards. Uh, I love these. They come in different shapes and sizes, but they uh, they have different type of projects that you can make with them depending on the punch board. So this one is called the explosion board, and here you can make um, some explosion cards. Uh, gift boxes and it's got all of the how to do it things um, they aren't too expensive I think I paid 14 pounds for this uh, off Amazon so um, yeah but it's, it's something really nice to receive uh, they've also got these tag punch boards so if the crafter in your life is making a lot of tags this could be a fun thing to receive as well. And then um, this envelope punch board by We Are Memory Keepers. Um, you don't only need to make envelopes with this, you can make gift boxes. There's a ton of different things you can make with it. So um, this one as well is a lovely gift to receive as a crafter. Then we've got paper pads and paper collections eBay has a few of these, so it's just to pretty much write in paper collection or paper pad 12 by 12 to receive a really nice 12 by 12 paper stack. It's lovely as well. I mean, I go through paper a lot. I love crafting with paper. That's why I call myself a paper crafter, obviously. Um, this one is from uh, Craft Consortium, and then I've got another collection here which is from uh, Reprint. So yeah, just have fun and, and pick a collection that you think your crafter would love and uh, they would be super happy to receive a, a 12 by 12 or an 8 by 8 or maybe even a 6 by 6 paper collection. I also want to recommend this LED lamp from Amazon. Ever since I got this, I've just used it every single day. Um, it's so good. And I've had it now for about, I think, eight months and uh, I've had no problem whatsoever with it. It's, um, the brand is called Le Prix, L-E, Le Prix, L-E, and uh, it really brightens up your desk. Um, I use it when I film YouTube videos. Um, it's, it's just really, really good. So that's a big recommendation. Um, if you have a bigger budget, I would recommend giving uh, your crafty person a scanning cut DX. This is a fabulous machine. I absolutely love it. I have a few videos about this machine that you can watch if you want to check it out. But your budget obviously needs to be higher then. I think this is about $1,100 uh, or something like that. I'm not sure the current price for it. Um, but yeah, I recommend this machine if if your crafter is really into um, their crafting, maybe even a Cricut or a Silhouette Cameo as well. Last but definitely not least, I've got uh, this lovely paper storage from Amazon here that I use uh, to keep all of my uh, colored paper uh, cardstock in. Um, it's really great. And uh, to give something like this to your crafter if they want to store their paper like this um, is a lovely gift as well. And that is all of my Amazon gift tips for 2021. I hope that they can be useful and that you can find something for the crafter in your life. I feel like I've said that so many times now. <laughs> but you know what I mean, you know, you've found something that will be appreciated by the crafter. So um, yeah, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and see you in my next video.